Thank you, Mr. Speaker. We can have health, re health care reform without raising taxes and costing jobs. The health care version currently being debated in Congress is recognized and called by many as a prescription for disaster. Disaster as it relates to ensuring quality and affordable health care, and disaster as to the impact it would have on our economy. Governors across the country, Republicans and Democrats, are fearful it would only add additional costs to an already unsustainable system. The Mayo Clinic says this bill misses the opportunity to help create higher quality, more affordable health care for our patients. In fact, they say it will do the opposite. CBO last week s stated it would worsen our economic outlook by increasing defic deficits and driving our nation more deeply into debt. There's many reasons to be skeptical of this plan. The job loss, the additional debt, the government intrusion between you and your doctor and your health care decisions. Some continue to say it's better than nothing. When you are sick or your son or daughter is sick, you don't want the doctor just to do something. You want him to do the right thing. Has expired. What purpose?